Many ways. There's a lot of activists that are supposed to be here today because Punch represented our newspaper for resistance in the 90s. Yes. Um, but in all my particular way, uh, I was a student union activist, as you all know, at the University of Lagos. And were it not for Punch newspaper and Vanguard, I probably wouldn't have graduated from the university. Yes, because we couldn't even get judges to hear our cases when we were expelled. And as you all know, I was expelled twice uh, from the University of Lagos. I spent six years at the University of Lagos instead of uh, the normal four. Um, but there's a particular story that none of you might have heard before when I went to serve in the northern part of the country, particularly at Damawa State. And I hope Stanley Yakubu also contributed to this book. Uh, when I went there, I finished my NYSC, and I was arrested and detained by the military under a bacha that I was planning to overthrow the government with NYC uniform. And uh, please listen to this story. So the reason was that in November 1995, I was working as a journalist at uh, ATV Yola presenting the NYC news. But being who I am, I'm not always interested where they put me. Uh, you know my lawyer is called Falano. Uh, the Yorubas will say Falano Botie, Tarayani Langbo, but I don't do the Falano thing in my private life. So I went and reported that Ken Sarawiwa was killed on ATV Yola. It's a recorded program. My supervisor did not watch it before it was played. And suddenly, everywhere went gaga. Uh, they pulled the news, removed me from ATV Yola, and then I finished my NYC, and I was arrested and detained in a military guard room at the NY, I mean, at the Air Force Base in Yola. And it was only because Stanley reported that a copper is being detained that they didn't forget me inside the place. I would have died. Yes, I'm still looking for it. It's a Northern Edition story. Please, in 1996, I've been looking for it in your library. Help me find it because I need to show up that. That was one of my detentions before, of course, Buhari and their people uh, also have done that. I'm still detained in Nigeria as we speak. Uh, but I'm glad that Mr. Uh, uh, Additional is here today. Uh, they had a great time. They had a great time detaining me and saying that Shewara is useless, stupid. Uh, but here we are today, you know, uh, the Yorubas will also say that uh, that's for the Yorubas. But today, uh, I was never given my NYC certificate. I don't have an NYC certificate as I stand in front of me. Never. But uh, I don't need it anymore. Because I've served the country more than any copper. Thank you very much, Punch, for serving our country with great journalism.